morning, boys and girls, faculty and staff. It is time for our Mustang Minutes. Our verse for the month of October comes from Ephesians 4, 2. Be completely humble and gentle. Be patient, bearing with one another in love. Birthday today to Kate Simpson and Mrs. Goss, Mrs. Goss class. Happy birthday on Saturday to Cooper Marshall and Mrs. Robinson's class, and to Nate Gross and Mrs. Thompson's class. And happy birthday on Sunday to Ms. Thomas McPherson and Mrs. Robinson's class. Choice for today will be pizza or a hamburger. First grade program is this morning. Good luck to all of the first graders. Also, sophomores is tonight. Good morning, everybody. I want to give you a couple of announcements on this Friday. The first one's right here. If you can see, high school's at 39%, elementary school's at 58%, and middle school is just one percentage point ahead of us in parent participation for the annual fund at 59%. We are two percentage points away from being ahead of the middle school and from somebody having to wear this hamburger costume. So I want to encourage all parents and children to encourage their parents uh, to give to the annual fund. It's all about participation, not necessarily about the amount. The second thing I want to show you, I'm going to put right on top of this music stand, and it's these cups. If you'll notice, I've got three cups here, a green cup, yellow cup, and a red cup. These cups are actually not for you. I'm not going to do a magic trick. and I don't want you to touch them, but you're going to see them on top of your cafeteria table. And here's how they work. You know, the cafeteria, you're to eat and not play with your food, talk with your friends, but don't shout, and sit down, don't stand up or run around. And most of us do a fantastic job with that. But there are times when some tables get a little bit out of hand. And if that happens, the cafeteria monitor is just going to come by and take the green cup off and let you know that you're being warned, that you're being too loud or too crazy, or you're not really doing what you're supposed to do in the cafeteria. Now, if you get to the next cup, the red, then there may be some sort of consequence for that. So this is just a visual reminder of how you should behave in the cafeteria. So you'll see these cups starting next week, the cafeteria monitors, that they will, they're gonna be the ones who touch those cups. Um, but this is a visual way for you to see how you're doing at lunch. And last thing, I just wanna promote a book. We have these books called, You Wouldn't Wanna Live Without. There's a series of them. Like, you wouldn't wanna live without extreme weather or you wouldn't want to live without insects. Look at this. These insects are eaten in some countries, including locust and larva and an insect lollipop. Who knew? So these books are, to, um, are available to check out in the library. Uh, we've got a whole bunch of them, about a dozen of them, that Mrs. Duncan just showed me. So come and check them out. They're pretty interesting. I read a little bit and liked them. You guys have a great Friday. Please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Mustang promise. This is the day that the Lord has made. Today, I promise to be honest and respectful, to treat others the way I want to be treated, and to be like Jesus, and please God in everything I do. Have a great weekend. See you next week for another edition of Mustang Minutes.